been good. It's been busy actually, much busier than I expected it to be. There's been uh, uh, a lot of travel involved doing the Formula One, doing the simulator work, um, the reserve role, and also the simulator. Oh, sorry, the, the DTM stuff. It's ended up being like a uh, a pretty busy year, actually busier than I was uh, during the race season in Formula One last year. So it's uh, it's been very busy, but at the same time, obviously uh, got to. Uh, Got to enjoy the, the 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 hard work with the with the seat next to you. Yeah, it's it's different because when you're in a in a in a race team when you're driving, you're always so focused on on the car and, and the engineers, and you're in your own little world. Where um, obviously this year I haven't been outside that much, so it's, a lot of it's been about looking at things from a different perspective, looking over it, and um, and at the end of the day. It's got me a perspective where I feel like I've got a better sense of how Formula One works, not just in driving, but you know, it's about the development, about the technology, about everything else that goes with that. Um, but also, you know, li listening to Max and Checo, understanding uh, their way of working and understanding if there's things that I can use that they do um, for myself. Yeah, so physically, to be honest, straight away after the last race of the year, um, last year, you were, we're training straight away, so it was almost like I've never left. I actually feel fitter than I, than I have been ever before. The one thing which you miss is the, uh, what do you call it, like the racing fitness, which is um, just your muscle memory, that when the more laps you do, you know, you build a, a certain fitness that you can't get from the gym, from, from running, from, from doing cardio, whatever it is. Um, so that's the main thing. Um, but then after then that, keeping sharp, a lot of it has been doing a little bit of the DTM stuff. Um, I've had a few tests this year already in, in the Formula 1 car with, with Red Bull. Um, but it will be tricky. It won't be easy um, to spend so long away from a car. You, you do need a little bit of that time to get back into the rhythm. Next year, I'm carrying Red Bull still with me. It'll still be on my helmet, and I'll still, uh, you know, be proud to carry the tie flag. Uh, I've had a lot of support, obviously, with Fiji uh, through throughout my whole career, um, and I want to keep that with me. Um, next year, it is a new, fresh start, so I am with Williams, and I will be focused with that. But of course, I still keep my links and my relationships with Red Bull. Um, in the future, you never know. Of course, there's there's possibilities uh, wherever I go. For me. The main thing is to do a good job next year, and you know, you never. It could even happen that next year the Williams is is the car to be in. It, it's that unpredictable with the new regulations for the next year. Well, firstly, I have to say I think it's been an amazing year. I feel like if you look at how it's gone with with Lewis and Max, each race different, just that close and to come into the final race, equal on points is something which is so so unheard of, especially in the current era where Mercedes have been the favourites for, for many years. So, uh, of course, I still wear, I'm still i still wearing my uh, my Red Bull shirts and I, and I want mine to do well. I feel like uh, it will be an interesting one. I feel like it's going to go down to the last lap. Um, and uh, I'm excited. I'm really excited to see how it goes. I feel like, you know, yesterday getting the pole position for, for Max was really important. And we have to use that as well as we can for the race. Uh, it's going to be one of them things that feel like, you know, over here right now, the atmosphere is tense. Of course it's tense. Then we'll have to see how it goes. Next season is going to be quite tricky because there's, there's not going to be um, that it's very unknown in that way, so we have to see how it goes. On my side, I think I have to focus on myself a little bit. I have to uh, just maximize what I can do in terms of what I've learned from, from this year, from my last few years in Formula 1, and see where it takes me. I feel like I just got to do the best job I can. And that involves, you know, working closely with Williams and giving as much experience and effort as I can to them and, and trying to help them. Um, you know, become a regular midfield team and, and, and see how, how that works out. It comes down to, at the end of the day, how much you want it. 
I think um, for me, I knew the only way that I was going to get a seat back was doing the most I could do uh, this year and working hard with everything I can do. So it turned out to me to just be one of them things where it was uh, it, it was just about pure pure hunger to be back in the seat. You know, I spent so long during this year being on the sidelines watching the cars go around the track uh, it only made me more hungry and it felt like um, it wasn't hard for me to to to, to bounce back in and focus on on, on my dreams <laughs> i would say my new year's resolution would be uh, so just firstly, just enjoy it. I think, um, you know, it's something which sounds a bit silly, but uh, you have to enjoy what you're doing. And obviously, there's a lot of, it's tricky, Formula One, and there's a lot of pressure. So that's basically it, um, going into next year. Uh, thank you for supporting me since day one. Uh, I feel like, uh, you know, I'm very proud to present Thailand and carry the side flag with me wherever I go. I feel like there's been a, uh, quite a tricky, year for me um, so thanks for, for keeping that support I see all the comments all the messages that you guys send me um, and yes uh, thank you for, to everyone hopefully I'll see you guys uh, in Thailand soon I don't know when I'll come over but I'm sure it will be hopefully next year now that uh, Thailand's opened up and I can come and see see everyone so yes thanks Thai.